What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ocarina of Time for the N64. In the last episode, we got made it to Ganon's castle, and holy crap, guys, are you guys prepared? Are your anuses prepared? Because mine ain't. <laughs> I don't know. Um, this is Ganon's castle, and holy crap, there is zero skull trolls in here because we have all the skull trolls. Yay! <laughs> uh, I just want to actually take a look. Like, look at all the progress we made. We have every slot filled, every single slot filled. Everything's 100% complete, guys. And it's crazy to me. I this was one of those games where like I'm never gonna 100% this because everything's too hard to keep track of. And here we are. All right, so. I just, everyone, what everyone tends to do is try to go from, do these in the order that, um, you know, you, you, like, accomplish the temples in. Like, you know, you do the forest one first, and the fire temp, or the, uh, the Dongo's Cavern one, but blah, 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 blah. But you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do the ones that have the least influence on me first, so, Nabru is probably the least influential, so let's go inside here first. I'm trying to think of all the sages, because I'm like, wait, is that, is, who, who's the most... Who's the least essential one in this party? Or the one that influenced me the least, I guess, is actually probably. Oh, nope, that did not do it. No! Pick it up! Yeah! Aw, oh, man. <laughs> Dude! We're gonna lock on and stop me for a brief second. Dude, I did it again! I'm gonna lock on. No. No! Come on, why is this so. I actually changed my lock on mode to hold the target, so I think that's why I'm all jumbled up now. I'm used to it not walking on. I mean, it is a different thing. Ooh, is a big fairy spawn there? Probably. Uh, okay, I'm gonna yo swag it. You guys ready? Hooah! I missed it. Hooah! Yeah! Am I just stuck in there forever? No, I'm not. Are you guys, are you guys ready again? Hooah! Yeah! I don't even care. Um, uh, ooh. Okay. I almost felt like that spike trap goes on an angle, but no. It's the angle of my camera. All right, let's hook shot. I'm gonna go ahead and guess there's a secret. Oh, it's not even a secret. I thought maybe I'd have to put on my lens of truth, but nope. Oh, I was like, where's the last one? Here it is. Here I am. Uh, come on, yeah, holy crap, how did I not get hit by that? All right, so yeah, we have a bunch of spots to go through here. That was embarrassingly easy. The heck, man, oh man. Oh. Oh, I was like, is this another area where we have to use the, uh, um, the thingamabob? Oh, it is. This is gonna be bomb chews. Choose the bombs. Okay, so I guess I was wrong when I said that's the only spot you have to use bomb chews. I guess there's two. I'm gonna use this first in case it gives me ten bomb chews. I doubt it would, but, you know. Is that gonna be good? And... Yeah! I guess... You know what? I bet they place those torches there so it's like a wider area that the bomb chew would explode. Open the chest, get on the flow. Everybody give me bomb chews. How many? Is my bomb- Oh, it is green! Yes! That makes me really freaking happy. I'm gonna beat this game with all my bomb chews. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless I just use it all in Ganon. I should just use all my supplies in Ganon. That would be hilarious. It really wouldn't. I mean, <laughs> I'm, in I'm insinuating we're gonna fight Ganon, but you know, we never know. Ooh. I wonder, I mean, the obvious solution here is a fire arrow whip, but what would happen if I went, like, this? We haven't seen an enemy yet that we could use the light arrow on, have we? Or maybe, maybe we could use it on the fire slugs. I don't know what we could use it on. Really? What the heck kind of dome of fire is this? Fine. You no know, way, stupid game. Go. Yeah, boom. How come using fire arrows takes away your magic? Let's, let's be serial here. I mean, we, we don't need magic to light arrows on fire. I mean, with ice, sure. And with fire, come on. Oh, holy crap! I didn't hear that at first. Okay. I had no idea if I was gonna spawn babies or not. Babies. Alright. And true, let's activate all these. Or in true, Chris fashion, let's activate all these. Yeah, totally dropping another one. Wait, what happens if it grabs me? Oh, I guess we will never know. Does it just teleport me to the beginning of the temple? I don't remember. I know it does that in all other Zelda games. Other unknown Zelda games that I'm going to play eventually. And one more. 
I, I really want to see what happens. Ha ha! Try to do something now, you punk. <laughs> Where are you gonna put me? The very beginning? Holy crap. Holy crap, man. Oh, my God. oh, I'm gonna have to get all the silver rupees again, aren't I? Well, that might be sucky. Let's see if this works. Oh, it's totally using up a lot of magic, doesn't it? Oh, no. What the heck? There's no way. No, stop it. Dude! Seriously? Oh, okay, I give up. <laughs> I try my hardest. I guess we'll never know if that works against those guys. Okay, I'm just gonna see you guys in a second. I'm assuming we have to get all the silver roops again. Oh, you don't. So I'm not gonna see you guys in a second. That Bemo seems bigger than the other ones. Weird. But then the usual ones, I should say. Okay, all these switch. You know what? Let's try this. Really? I didn't even kill him one hit. I wish the Light Rose were as OP in this game as they are in other Zelda games that I will be playing eventually, so I'm not gonna mention. <laughs> okay, we already hit all those, so we're not gonna hit them again. Screw that jazz. And here we are. You better drop magic, you stupid pot. Yeah, you better drop magic, you stupid pot. No, you dropped me nuts for some odd reason. Oh, oh, okay. Then. So yeah, we see these. It's like, oh, that's really neat. Boom! Crap, did I see a chest or something over there? No, to the right there, you can see it. And boom! Hello, beautiful. The spirit barrier is dispelled! Hurry up, kid! Is that all you say? That's stupid. That's silly. Um... Kinda feel the need to take a look at my list and see all the other sages. Well, there's five or six. Hmm, I don't remember. And zoop! That is pretty cool, they'll disappear. Alright, let's take a look here. Well, which one was also not very... Okay, Spirit, obviously. I think Impa was probably the, the second least. There's also another one of these things. And I kind of feel like... Wait, what color is that? No. Oh, that's the light. Well, actually, this guy was the least influential. Well, that's not true, because he was the owl. And he was pretty important to us on our quest. I think Spirit's going to be our next best bet here. So let's go along. Let's go along and do the spirit. I mean the, the shadow temple. Let's go along and hit this stupid guy. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to hit him. Ah! Oh, that was bad. That was really bad. Like holy poop, was that ever bad? Yeah, the crappy thing in this game is that you can't use any of your um, or you can't set any option settings without quitting the game. Like. I put the game on, um, oh boy, that I would now have to hold the L button to target on enemies, but I've decided now that that was probably a bad idea since that doesn't seem to work out too well in this game. And yeah, I died when I didn't even mention it because it was really stupid. Stupid! What are you stupid? Alright. I totally could have hookshot into this! I'm stupid. I should not make fun of myself like the how dare I. Is there a dungeon map here? Can I make that? I would no, I cannot. But that's okay. Only takes away one heart, right? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. All right, let's go. Bam! All right, let's do this. When you're ready, come and get it. <laughs> na, na, na. Like, like, I will dispel you with. Whoa. Can I kill you with one hit with a later? I should be able to, right? It'd be cool if you could equip multiple arrows at once. What happened if I hit him with a nice arrow? Damn, I guess we got- Are you serious? The hell, light arrows? Oh, great, I could've used that magic. It's all your fault, like, like, you asshole. It literally just looks like an, a, an asshole. It's pretty gross, actually. Yay, five freaking poopies. Give me magic. That, and don't fall off the What the- Really? Really, game? Really? Arrows! Okay, well, I mean... Um, I cannot make that jump. Is there... Do I just have to hit that switch again? There's something else I'm missing here. Oh, that's a hook shot target over there. Forgot about that. Uh, keep in mind, this is one of the first... Uh, this is the first time I've ever done this, so... I'm gonna be a bit unsure of what to do in some spots. <laughs> oh, I do have a green potion, though. That's good. Guess I gotta stop wasting my uh, magic. 
Did I get it? No, of course not. That'd just be too great now, wouldn't it? Bam, shakalaka! Yes? Yes! Yes! What's down here? A switch. Don't miss, please. I wanna know what the switch does. Ah! Oh, that one stays there, apparently. Okay, that's good. Probably don't need my bombs anymore. Uh, I've talked about this in the past, I think. But the bottom of my teeth are actually a bit crammed together. Otherwise, my teeth are pretty perfect. But the bottom, like, four teeth in my mouth are all scrunched together. And occasionally, they'll really start to hurt because they'll be, like, really strained and push each other around. <gasps> Holy crap, you get an item in this dungeon? What the heck? You found the golden gauntlets. You can feel even more power coursing through your arms. Grab A and lift stuff up. Yay! A! And lift stuff up. Uh, okay, so I guess we gotta use this again. We got one shot. I could barely even see it from here. Crap. Uh, oh man, I can't even really see it from here. Ah! That was a sh stupid shot. That sucked. So can I lens of truth this? That'd be great. So platforms are there technically, right? I can't even use it because I don't even have any magic. Let's go ahead and drink this. I am actually glad that I accidentally bought a green potion from a dick who's scrub or a business scrub. <sighs> now it is helping me. What the? I did not mean to press that button, dude. I don't. Oh, oh. What the? Oh. Cool. There was a path here that leads when I hit that torch, though, isn't there? This is a, I feel like it's gonna be a rusty switch. It is. How did I know? It's because of magic. But anyway, so the bottom of my teeth are really hurting right now. It essentially feels like if you could remember what it was like when your adult teeth were growing in and they, were, they start teething and stuff, you know? That's pretty much what that feels like. So, I've talked about this before, but it's it's frustratingly... It's not really frustrating, it's just it's kind of painful. But it's like a constant pain. Uh, the only way to fix it, I talked to a doctor before, it would be to get glasses. Or, <laughs> glasses. <laughs> My glasses pop in mind. Um, uh, but yeah, I would have to get braces, and it's like, it's not really that bad. Not bad enough to want to spend thousands of dollars. Alright, we're gonna wait. Uh, oh, wait a minute! We don't even need that, apparently. That probably activates those weird spider web paths behind. Oh, these aren't spider webs! This is just a stone path! I've never noticed that before. I totally always thought these are spider webs. They look like spider webs, right? But they're just very faint stone paths. That's cool. Hey, look, it's a thing. We did it! Yay! Is there, okay, is there, no, there's no pop there. I thought actually, on the Spirit Temple one, I totally thought there was a redead. Like, right, standing right here. But no, I guess not, unless I just didn't see it. Right. Let's shoot a firework on it for some stupid reason. Bam! Nothing happens! Alright, you literally at it for some reason. And... BAM! Yay! I did it! Wait, what? The shadow the do the shadow bear used this bell, please save the princess. Wait a minute. Actually, I thought you had to go behind the wall in this one. Wait, you stupid? What? What just happened? I'm so confused. Alrighty then. That's really weird. I almost feel like going back just to see if I can go behind the wall. I could have sworn because you know the Shadow Temple's one with tricksies and stuffsies. Um, okay. Now we've done that. I'm gonna go do the owl one because with the golden gauntlets, we could do something pretty freaking amazing actually. And that is you go to this and you press A and it says grab now. And I am Superman! And that is freaking awesome. The only thing that kind of detracts from the awesomeness is the fact that all the rubble disappears. And you know what? I'm actually not going to do that yet. Instead, I'm going to end the episode. Just kidding. Not yet. But I probably technically should. Uh, there's one more thing we need to do. We have seen one of those giant blocks before. These giant gray blocks. Where was it? I don't know. Where was it? Can you tell me? Does this bear hurt me? I think it probably should. No, it doesn't. It just makes a stone noise when you hit it for some reason. So yeah, we're gonna go back out of the temple. 
Why? Well, just wait and see. Just wait and see. You'll see the same guys. I don't think you get a dungeon map in this place, do you? Kind of unfortunate, but you know, it's pretty. It's a pretty short dungeon. It's a fairly short last dungeon, to be honest. Let's go outside real quick and be like, "Yay, Ganon's castle!" Oh, the birds are crowing, the wind is howling. What a beautiful day in the evil neighborhood. Can now pick up these rocks as well. Wait, can we do that before? I think we could with the silver gauntlets. Can I walk? No, but I do look all silly and stubby. Let's we lift from this side. Oh man, the camera is gonna freaking turn around, isn't it? Maybe not. I'm having so much fun. And I'm back. One interruption later. Can I see if I get the camera to cooperate here? I want to see what. No, I want to see what Link looks like picking up from the front. He's gonna put his face under the rock. Okay, that's good. Okay, we threw it, and now we threw it on the ground. Now I'm gonna pick up the rock. Thanks, Navi. That's really helpful. Who put this giant block inside of the freaking fairy fountain? So powerful. We did it! Yeah! And this one just doesn't explode and stuff for some reason, but. You know, wasn't this just a tiny little hole to crawl through before? Why did it get bigger? Anyways, this is the last fairy fountain. Great fairy fountain in the game. Very last. Aw, oh, I had to try it one last time. Okay. Let's do it legitimately. Okay. Well, look at that face in the background on top of the door. Do you see it? There's like wings on it. It's like a weird angel thing. <gasps> Don't you giggle at me, you ass what? With boobs. The babes. What? Don't give me that look. Girl, look at that body with your three blocks of hair. Welcome, Link. I am the great... I am the great fairy of courage! I'm going to enhance your defensive power! Receive it now! Oh yeah, bicep and thighs! Yeah! I don't know, they're just... Maybe Impa's part of the great fairies! <gasps> Holy crap. It, it, it's because they totally seem similar. Oh, ah, man, white lace hearts! Which always reminds me of Valentine's Day for some reason. I don't know, when people say laced hearts, I just think of those like Doyle things that go on, go with uh, Valentine's Day things. Sparkly vaginas. Your defensive power has been enhanced. Damage inflicted by enemies will be reduced by half. When battle has made you wary, I just dropped my controller. Please come back to see me. I do not even know how much you guys heard that clearly. <laughs> <sighs> We're done here. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Let's Play Ocarina of Time. With our defensive powers and hands. I I'm actually really curious what fighting Ganon would be like without the enhanced defensive powers. Because I always see that. See people, whenever I've seen people play this game, they always get the enhanced power thing. And that bridge is breaking in and out of existence. Um, but yeah, so I'd like to take a moment and say thank you guys so very much for watching. This is Let's Play is coming right to an end. I'm gonna go ahead and guess three or four more episodes and that'll be the end. And I'll never play this again except for when I blind play Ocarina of Time 3DS. Yes. Just kidding, that probably won't happen. It never does, it'll be for a few years. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. In the next one, we'll probably get through the majority of the rest of these rooms. Wait, is there a chest behind me? There's not. Ha ha ha! that's a story. Uh, silly dual lasers. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you next time. Goodbye.